right? Yeah, for sure, right? I, hey, good morning, New Mexico. We are taking a different camera angle now with our KOT action camera overlooking the Sandias. Yeah, the sun rising over the Duke City. We are off to a very, very cold start right now in the metro. We're sitting right at that freezing mark, 32 degrees. Northeast winds at 10 miles per hour makes it feel even colder by uh, a couple of degrees. We're talking 24 is what it feels like. So definitely need the layers as you step out the door this morning. Freezing fog advisory in effect for areas of northwest New Mexico, including Farmington. Uh, we could see areas of low visibility and slick roadways up until nine o'clock this morning. But so far on those camera shots that we've taken so far in Farmington that uh, no fog has developed so far, which is the great news because we want things to go off without a hitch, right? 10 degrees right now in Taos, bitterly cold for you folks. 18 degrees in Raton, matching that too in Durango. Down towards the southwest half of the state, we are in the 20s today. Uh, but as we plan out the rest of your Sunday, you're going to notice our temperatures are going to be slightly warmer this afternoon than they were the day before. Uh, we should reach our high temperature right around three o'clock of 55 degrees. Yesterday, we were in the 50s. Today we are traveling or trekking to the mid 50s, I should say. But again, as soon as that sun sets, the temperatures plummet across the metro. Elsewhere across the state today, it's going to be nice and mild, and I would say even warm for southeast New Mexico. Uh, close to 70 degrees for you folks down towards Roswell, Carlsbad, and Hobbs. So get outdoors if you can. Maybe enjoy a nice little lunch outside too. It's probably going to feel really great, especially since our winds are, are going to be pretty light today. In the mid 50s for areas like Gallup and Grants in the upper 50s today. Tonight is going to be a Another cold night, we are going to see temperatures uh, below freezing for many locations and right at freezing for other parts, which includes TRC and Hobbs comes close to being at that freezing mark too. As for tomorrow goes, you're going to notice this increase in cloud cover that's going to be pushing in from the west towards the east. High level clouds mainly for tomorrow that makes us partly sunny, but there is a backdoor cold front and that's going to shut off a couple degrees for many areas of eastern and central New Mexico. So we are in the mid 50s today, low 50s tomorrow and check it out down towards southeast New Mexico. I think you're are going to feel that big hole down the, the most because again, close to 70 degrees today, then tomorrow uh, back into the mid 50s. So pretty chilly for you folks. As we fast forward through the rest of the work week, our rain and snow chances really do uptick. I think the first half of the week, though, it's going to be mainly rain. It's not until Friday night into Saturday morning where we can throw in some snow flurries mixed in that here in Albuquerque. All right, let's put it together now for that northwest New Mexico forecast. We are in the upper 40s today, low 50s tomorrow. Then we increase those rain chances for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday night into Saturday. We could see some snow flurries mixed in there for Farmington. Southwest New Mexico, we're in the mid 60s for Lordsburg, Deming. In Silver City, in the upper 50s, a little bit warmer tomorrow. But again, that increase in cloud cover begins tomorrow. And then we increase our rain chances really on Friday and then Friday night into Saturday. Saturday, uh, we're throwing some snow flurries mixed in there as well. Southeast New Mexico, it's going to be a very beautiful, comfortable afternoon with a lot of sunshine. Try to get outdoors if you can. Cold start to the day tomorrow, and of course, our temperature is a little bit cooler with that backdoor cold front. There's those rain chances towards the end of the week into next weekend. Uh, northeast New Mexico, we are in the mid-50s for Las Vegas, low-50s for Raton and Moriarty. A lot of sunshine today. We increase that cloud cover tomorrow, and then I think we'll see better rain and snow chances come Saturday. But still keeping them in the forecast for Thursday into Friday. 48 will be our high for Los Alamos, matching that in Chama. Good morning to you. Upper 40s for Santa Fe. More cloud cover tomorrow and a little bit cooler with that backdoor cold front arriving. In the metro, it's going to be a mild afternoon with temperatures in the mid-50s, upper 50s for our River Valley communities. And here's that seven-day forecast. We're going to impact the weather for next Saturday. Of course, that could change as weather models right now say things are looking to be the most wet that day.